What's up YouTube, Xavier Elon here. I'm actually not going to be doing intros anymore. Uh, take up too much time and it takes too long to edit them and nobody really watches these videos anyways. So, I'm just going to be going right into it from now on. Uh, ugly number, write a program to check whether a given number is an ugly number. Ugly numbers are positive numbers whose prime factors only include 2, 3, and 5. So, basically, uh, it's simple explanation only prime factors so it can include like 7 um, 11 stuff like that so um, the intuition behind this is we just divide by divide the number by um, I already have the answer let me clear it we just divide the number um, by th these three prime factors as much as we can and if the remainder is one then it is an ugly number and if not it isn't um, so if like we do 14 we would try 14 divided by 2 and we would get 7 so it does divide evenly but we can't divide it by 2 anymore we can't divide it by 3 anymore and we can't divide it by 5 anymore so it's not a ugly number and then we just return false so um, ugly numbers are positive numbers so that's uh, we got to check for that I think it's actually one. And so now we're just going to divide num. We're going to use the modulus. And while it divides evenly, we're going to keep doing it. And here. So let's just do that for three and five as well. That was supposed to be five. And then if the number is one left over, uh, it's true. Otherwise, it's false. So let's return num. And that should work. Uh, Output false. So it was just less than one. And there you have it. So this is just, um, I don't even know the space complexity. Well, the space is definitely um, constant O of one. And the runtime would be, I believe, O of one as well because it's such a limited number of calculations. And that's all I got for you guys. If you guys haven't already, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Yeah.